The white ladies are dancing.
Gotta make a small interruption. Just a small interruption. Sharon Richmond, please come to the manager's office. Sharon Richmond, gotta make a small interruption. Right, it's not Sharon Richmond. Ah, uh, this is Tayji. No, I know her. Hey, hey, what's up? Hey, what's up? You see, you see. Uh, so Sharon Richmond, please come to the manager's office. 
is to put the package inside the animal. Open the animal's mouth, put a bite bar there, and reach down his throat, place the package in his fore stomach, placing a single suture in the wall of the fore stomach so that the animal can't regurgitate it. And without observable uh, complications to the animal's uh, digestive process, this package can stay there uh, almost indefinitely. This package can weigh in the neighborhood uh, five to nine pounds. Or if you wish to place a slightly larger packet, package, you can surgically implant it in the abdominal cavity itself. Procedure number four is to have the animal put his beak into a toe ring. Through this toe ring is a toe line, a toe line that flows beneath the arm of the animal. At the end of this toe line, there is a fetal-like package, which is also hydrodynamically designed so that independent of the speed or gyration of the animal, it will stay approximately three feet beneath and three feet behind it. This package is also neutrally buoyant, so that at any time or in any place, the animal can shuck it or come back and pick it up. Procedure number two for instrumenting this weapons platform is that you cause him, the animal, to place his feet in the rear end of a torpedo-shaped object and he pushes that object through the water. This package can be a great range of up to 30 pounds. This package, for instance, can be used in the swimming notification system where inside this torpedo be mounted our object Dr. Image, Dr. And of course there's no, of course there's no, of course there's no.
Take two. Okay, let's stop here. Cut. Get on lady, all get on It's on clay.
Technology rings the bell. And it's technology. Technology rings the bell. Can everybody hear me? Cautious tone. Please go. Now, you know, 
the whole thing is going to come from the past to the rest. I'm going to hit you. I'm happy Okay, you guys, I'm just going to set the first of like four bars. And uh, Susie has, she can do anything she wants with it, but I want to get you guys started on the feel from last night. Talk and we get together. Yeah. I'm just gonna do the first four, five, six bars or whatever, just to give you the feel on the cautious top line. And then, you know, she's gonna start whatever she feels from that. But I just want to start with the idea from last night. All right. Cautious time. What? What? Excuse me, Scott. Can Scott? Can you repeat that? This, you know, and uh, whatever you want to do, because I'm afraid Susie can't resist you. Um, and then I, after I stop singing about 10 bars, 12 bars in, Scott, stop and go back to the top so we can let Susie do it, okay? Pictures, your resumes, and your cassette tips with the girl. All right, come on, so that Susie's dying to sing this song, you guys. Hey, hey! Thank you very much. We have your cards and pictures. You will not accept your checks. Let's do it. And like I said, 10, 12 bars. Scott, because Susie, if, if I stand any longer, she's going to start knifing me in the back. Just play, Mitch. You'll be wonderful. What did Mitch say? Oh, Michael needs more Michael. Oh, yeah, particularly on this tune. Yeah, let's tune up. That's a great idea. Who thought of that? You're fired. <laughs> Just give it to you here with a blank uh, silence. Cautious talk. Cautious talk. Right? Do, 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 So we're talking about, in the bridge, we're talking about, uh, yeah, the last four bars of the bridge. And uh, let me just sing it for you guys without anybody playing. 
And I want you so much. Elvis Presley shit. <laughs>